World service for the late Free State Stars midfielder Sinatema Yankee is expected to be held at Bethlehem today. He was killed in a car crash, you'll remember, on Monday morning in Bethlehem. Our reporter Tabisa Khadebe is covering the story for us. He joins us now live uh, with regards to what can we expect. Tabisa, obviously a, a somber mood. Just tell us a bit about this Free State Star. But well... Yes, of course, uh, Blaine. Good morning to you and your listener or your viewer at home. I'm coming to you live from uh, Bushokong at the New Hall here in Bethlehem, where uh, supporters, hundreds of supporters, are expected to uh, give homage uh, to one of their own, uh, Sinatemba Yankee. Uh, you'll recall that uh, he passed on on uh, Sunday uh, due to a, a car crash, uh, his uh, uh, vehicle crashing with uh, a, a truck. Uh, according to uh, uh, the police. Uh, so I'm here, S supporters have started arriving in their numbers uh, to pay their last respect. Yes, of course, uh, I spoke to some of them here. Uh, it's a somber mood. They are set to lose, to lose one of their own, one of the talented players uh, uh, who was playing for uh, Yalla Koto, as they are affectionately affectionately uh, known. Uh, Sinatamba was playing for uh, Mbombela United before he joined uh, Free State Stars uh, uh, in, on, in 2016. And uh, what, did, what I can tell you, Blaine, uh, he was on the verge of uh, signing for a uh, bid vest vets. I'm told that uh, he was on the wanted list of uh, uh, Gavin Hunt's uh, 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 guys, a uh, 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 bench or rather uh, players uh, at uh, bid vest vets. But fortunately, I managed to get the managing director of the team to talk to us about the, uh, the passing of uh, as in September, Ndate Ransi Mukwena, to tell us more about this uh, talent who passed on. Ndate Mukwena, uh, good morning. Uh, just tell us about the, 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 the player that we have lost in September. Yeah, I think we've lost a, an exceptionally good player, uh, an exceptionally incredible human being, um, somebody who, upon arrival at Fisher Stars, has just, you know, continued to shine. Um, I think you know, if those who watch football, you know that you know uh, his current form was just you know uh, something to really, really just write home about. Um, against Bluefield Celtic, he scored a brace, many, many assists um, in the last couple of games. Um, he was really, really an, uh, an important member of, of, of our squad. We're talking Sinatamba Yankee at the moment. Three years ago, two years ago, we were talking about Richard Tenyaganya. It, it must be a concern that uh, your players are dying in, in, in car crashes. I think it's a concern for in the industry uh, generally. Uh, it's not a free sister's concern uh, necessarily. Um, we speak of uh, Richard Tenyaganya, but we must speak of Trailer as well. Um, we must speak of the late Gift Remy, Lismania Taylor, and so on. The list is very, very long. And I think it is a concern, and I think it is a, a, a conversation that as industry we need to have and engage on to say uh, what is causing all this and um, how can we intervene. Mm. Uh, talking about those engagements in terms of educating uh, the players, uh, I, I suppose at Free State Stars you have got some, some of those programs where you 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 teaching, educating your players about life outside football, life outside Free State Stars. Life skill, not, not, not necessarily just, you know, uh, driving, whatever, but just general life skill. Um, the importance of saving money, the importance of investing your money in, in certain areas, the importance of live, living a, a clean lifestyle um, as sports people. Um, so yeah, we do definitely have those programs. Um, but I think, like I say, I think we need to have a bigger conversation, specifically around uh, cars and accidents that are happening within, in, within our industry. It has been reported that uh, you are about to meet the family and discuss and arrange the funeral of September. Or how, how are the arrangements going in terms of going to the funeral in the Eastern Cape uh, over the weekend? No, we have arranged. Um, we Tomorrow the whole club leaves um, to travel to Queenstown. And on Saturday is the funeral in Wittosi where uh, September comes from. Um, the family arrived, um, I think, on the Monday evening, um, and we met Tuesday, Tuesday morning, to obviously try and address uh, all these issues. 
you know, around the memorial service which is today and uh, the funeral which is in uh, Wusasi uh, on Saturday. Mm. As the managing director of the club, I have seen some couple of supporters from other teams here. Uh, uh, how, how does it feel for you as a team? We know that uh, it, it's 90 min in, in 90 minutes you are enemies with other teams playing in the soccer field, but we've seen other supporters here. How does it feel as, as Free State stars? Yeah, not just the guys who are here. I think um, the messages of, 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 of condolences that we received throughout the world has been humbling. Um, you know, um, we are in industry. We are one. Um, uh, we are colleagues in football, um, and you know, I, I do expect a few other teams to arrive, which have confirmed that uh, you know they were attending. But it is humbling that uh, in a time like this, um, your colleagues were indeed to support you. Uh, Blaine Ntatemukwena uh, talking to us about uh, uh, Sinatemba Yankee. Uh, obviously, uh, as I mentioned earlier on, that uh, it's a somber mood here. People are, have started flocking into this hall here, uh, uh, the new hall in uh, uh, Bushukum, Bethlehem. I managed to get hold of some of uh, supporters here just to talk to us, just to hear how they feel about one of their own, one of their players. I've got Mema Mukhela here who will tell us, uh, uh, Sinatemba Yankee, one of your players, Ntatayan Albapa Lasko Pasalona, Li Kutwa Juanka, hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. Blaine Mokhele explaining to us that uh, uh, they will always support support this team. They are said uh, of the passing of uh, Sinatemba. Uh, I've got another supporter here, Ntatemukwena, who's going to be telling us about uh, the passing of uh, Sinatemba. Ntatemukwena, Luena Kamushomong Ukule Bushokuka Lifule. And <laughs> Supporters <laughs> All right, Blaine Ndatemukwena and Mema Mokhele explaining to us their sadness about the passing of uh, uh, Sinatemba. Uh, Blaine, as you heard from the managing director, arrangements are at an advanced stage uh, for the team uh, uh, to travel to uh, Eastern Cape on Saturday uh, to pay uh, their last respect to their player, uh, Sinatemba uh, Janki. It's back to you, Blaine. Yeah, promising life indeed cut short. Great reporting there, Tabiso Khadebe, life for us in uh, Bethlehem. We do appreciate your reporting. Okay, let's take a quick break, but first, you weather.